All right, welcome back to Ebony with Genghis, server 136. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Uh, this is actually my third or fourth time recording this video because I actually just saw some stuff that uh, changed my mind on a couple things. Uh, don't forget, always check your truce agreement. So we're going to go into the, gen the tavern here. We're looking at archer generals today. Now, there's tons of videos out there on, well, I shouldn't say tons because there's not lots of YouTubers for Ebony, unfortunately, but almost every YouTuber has done a general series. Mine's a little different, so it's why I'm doing it. So the other YouTubers I really like who cover this sort of stuff is uh, Devon is good, The Miser and KX Why Not. They're all really good at this. There's some other ones out there as well, but those are the channels that I typically like to watch. So if we go into Korea here, this is the fifth most important archer general in the game. Now, oh, sorry, he's not in Korea. He's in China. Lee Shimin, he is not the fifth best archer general, but he's the fifth most important. And the reason for that is he's the best free general you will get in the tavern. So he's a good archer general. He just, when you come to end game, he's not an end game general, but if you get on a new server and you're lucky enough to get him, you can just dominate with him for the first three, four months of the server until you get one of the other four generals. And this is a great general. I see lots of people with him still, and there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, he's a good general for sure. Now, the fourth best general. So Lee Shimin was the fifth most important general, but I'm really only covering four generals here. As I said, Lee Shimin's only importance is that he's free in the tavern and he's far better than any other archer general available in the tavern. Electra is the fourth best general in the game. She's sort of tied for third and fourth with the next guy, but Electra's fall, fault is this right here, Holy Knight only goes up to plus 26, where the other peoples go higher. But she can put an attack march buff on her, where the other person cannot. So if we're not going to develop the fourth talent, Electra's the third best. But when fully developed, she becomes fourth best. So they're sort of tied, these two uh, generals. And the other one right here, Minamoto... As you can see, he's free in the fragments this month, but as you can see here, plus 46% on the final skill. And then his other skills are all amazing as well. Uh, so he's better than Electra when they're fully developed. But this column right here, this fourth one, is so hard to develop. Not many people do it for not many of their generals in the game because you have to unlock one, two and three before you could do four and those those uh, rune stones are the most difficult to get don't forget to check out my rune stone video on how to get free rune free rune stones well not free but trade gold for rune stones it's a excellent video now i must say obviously self-promotion now let's get to the top two generals and minamoto's big drawback is uh he cannot add an, at an attack buff and the reason he can't is if you look at Shanao, his skill, it only increases the ranged troops, right? So you can't add one on that. But if you go over to Electra here, where I'll go to her again, and you read Blood Restraint, it increases mounted and ranged. So she can add a attack book. Now, these are the top two, and they're much better than the third and fourth ones. But, again, they're all excellent generals. So, number two, not many people do not know about this guy. They kind of snuck him in about two months ago. He is awesome. One of my boys, uh, Ryder25 in Doc, he has uh, this guy, and he was actually kind of uh, disappointed, and then I pointed him to uh, someone's video about him. I can't remember who the user was. It's too bad. I'd like to plug him. But he did an excellent video on Archer Generals, and this guy is awesome, okay? Uh, the only... He's just slightly worse than the top guy, and the reason for that is right here. All troop attack, 6%. Okay? So all troop attack, 6%. 
And then we're going to look at the top guy. Number one, it's Alfred. They're almost identical. And the reason they're different is, so right here, right? Instead of all troop attack, he has all three ranged buffs up 10. So if you're going with a full archer rally with slight layering, this guy's going to give you that extra 4% on not only attack, but then 10 more on HP and defense. So uh, 0685, just uh, counting up here right now. Uh, yeah, so they grow at about the exact same pace. Simeon is 9.1. Alfred grows at 8. 9.0 and attack they grow the same and Simeon grows a little bit quicker on defense but that extra skill right there this one where, where it's six instead of 10 10 10 for Alfred is a difference maker and most people are going to go with him now when it comes to books you this is what I do I go up here and I'm going to go into rankings general rankings and I look at the top players on my server so if I want to see what someone's doing with their top generals, I'll click on that player and I'll look at someone I respect. Just because it's near the top, it doesn't mean it's a player that I respect and think that they're going to have the best books on it. One guy that I think is just awesome at this game, let me see if I can find him. It kind of looks like he changed his name. Oh, this is him right here. So Mujahid, just a ruthless player just uh, crushes everybody, but very good. I believe he got top 10 in Battlefield All-Stars at the middle level. And now you click on his general and you look at what books he put on. So he put ranged attack, ranged bonus, and march size. So basically every single general, what you're gonna do, if it's an archer general, you're automatically gonna put range bonus. That's a given, no matter what. And then it comes down to, can you put attack the top? So Electra, yes. Simeon and Alfred, yes. Minamoto, you cannot. So then you have decisions to make. But he goes with March Size. And that's one of the books. There's obviously just five books to put on an Archer General. HP, Defense, Attack, Range, and March Size. So you got to pick three of those five. And in some cases, like when you look at Minamoto here, I think this might be uh, Moon's general. He is uh, he made it to Battlefield All-Stars, didn't do uh, overly well, but it's a huge accomplishment just to make it. Uh, I believe he put up uh, 550 points, which doesn't sound like much when people are putting up tens of thousands, but... It was his first time, and I'm sure he's going to make a better go of it next time. So as you can see, he has a maxed general, and I think this is his. It might be someone else's, but I know he has a maxed Minamoto. The name has changed, so it's probably him. So he went with ranged bonus, ranged defense, and range HP. Personally, when I get my Minamoto, I'm going to go this book for sure, and then I have a decision to make. I think I'm going to go with defense and march size. And this player... Uh, we got another Minamoto right here on player, new player. Oh, he went with siege range bonus, range troop bonus, and siege attack. I will just say that I completely disagree with that. I don't know what he's doing, but hey, it's his general, and he can do what he wants with that. Uh, maybe it's just not fully developed maybe he's going to change books at some point but uh what you i i encourage you to all look here all the time this is user goku with alfred he is one of our top pvp uh players on the server no doubt about it uh he's always in some sort of uh rogue situation though it seems where he's fighting the world and it does limit his growth but uh he seems fine with it, and you know what? We all enjoy the game a different way, so let him to it. But he goes with ranged attack, ranged bonus, and ranged HP, and that's that. So I encourage you all to look at general rankings before you put books on your player. I do it all the time, and I like to see that I'm going to have the same books. Just look at Joseph Johnson here, and yeah, these are the exact same books I have on my Joseph Johnson, only his is... Uh, way better so 
Thanks to another uh, visiting for another session of Ebony with Genghis, Server 136. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Uh, I will have some live streaming this weekend for server versus server. So uh, I'll see you then.